Komm in Rostock. Ja, komm in Rostock. Nein. The most beautiful Brazilian boat. Tell me. Okay, she doesn't want to say it, I'll say it. <laughs> we're on the way to the North Sea right now. Because what we're doing now is we're leaving uh, Rostock behind. Where are we going to? To Kiel. To Kiel. And after that to Cuxhaven. From Cux Cuxhaven to... To... Well, we don't really know because that will depend on the wind. And my parents, they're coming! Yeah. <laughs> Almost uh, arriving in Kiel, should be another four hours. We we'll get there maybe by evening, it might be dark by then. Let's hope not. With the spinnaker here flying, we'll get maybe a little bit faster. Love to see this spinnaker flying, man, it's beautiful. Check it out. We just broke a new record. What? 8.3. What? I'm talking about. We're still flying our spinnaker and we are consistently doing between seven and a half and eight knots. Can you check this out? Consistently. Did you, did you know a boat could go that fast? You just broke a new record. No, that was great. What a time. We had a few problems. Larissa burned her hand, tried lowering down the spinnaker. How's it, how's it looking? Ah, oh, Jesus. Okay, that's bad. I'm sorry, you gonna survive? I think so. But at, at least we got like a Guinness to warm up her hand. You all know by now how much she likes Guinness, so. <laughs> it's getting quite hectic. We're making surfing 9.4 down the waves and uh, we just uh, we waited too long to lower the spinnaker down and uh, there was too much pressure even though know, we tried to put it behind the mainsail it, it was quite a lot of pressure but uh we're alive tomorrow we're about to take the big channel it's gonna be a massive achievement for us yeah sailing down pretty much the whole of the baltic sea from north to south it was a great day what an achievement yeah. what an achievement this would be the original route to exit the baltic into the north sea a very long stretch of very naughty seas. But now, instead of that, we can take this route. Ladies and gentlemen, the Kiel Canal. The locks are opening now. Ah, there you go. It went so smooth, we didn't even see it. The Kiel Canal is a massive shortcut, something like the Panama Canal. Instead of having to sail all around the top of Denmark and then back down to Germany, the channel saved us about 400 nautical miles and became only a 50 mile stretch of a very pleasant navigation, avoiding the stormy and unpredictable waters of the North Sea. As most stories in Europe go, this area was widely disputed by Norwegians, the Danish and the Germans. But after that area became Prussian and later German territory at around 1887, the channel was finished by the Germans. It took something like 8 years and 9,000 workers to get it done. So now we can easily cross it completely in one day, from Kiel straight to Brunsbüttel. But don't get too relaxed just now, because once you're in Brunsbüttel, because once you're in Brunsbüttel, because once you're in Brunsbüttel, because <laughs> once, once you're in Brusbuto, you would still have to sail out of the locks into a very strong tidal river mouth of the Elbe. And from there, well, the North Sea would still be waiting. Lisa's parents have just arrived, she's freaking out because uh, they're over there. So we're gonna see if we can find them. What is? Who's arrived? Where are they coming from? Uh, Madrid. Madrid. Oh, <laughs> 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 
Challenge. Of time to a dock. It's either to a boat, to a mooring ball, to a pier, <laughs> to a jetty, to, to a, another boat, to a floating piece of something. Temos convidados ilustres aqui estamos, hoje. Estamos cruzando. Estamos cruzando o canal de Kiel para Brunsbutter. <música> <risos> e aí, dona Nenê? Achei legal e bem louco, né? Bem louco. <risos> Tomamos café, terminamos, Mas corremos. A digestão eu já fez. Já. Pô, tá aqui, nós assistimos uma correria do Cris e da We're gonna go to Cooksoffin today and probably just chill around there. Ah, this is a do it takes a fight. Ah, then I came out. Steady, steady, 10.8 over the ground. Okay, I think a bomb just fell in here. <laughs> or something like that. Clarissa's parents just left and there was stuff it's everywhere. You okay. are the mess. You are the mess. Okay, I see. And now we're trying to sort it out because in a few hours, without any sleep, uh. we might just be leaving to one of the biggest crosses of our lives. <sighs> Let's stock up, let's pile up our food. I think it takes a different type of human being to be wanting to do that. Why are you so nervous? Amazing, amazing power of nature, amazing power of the river Elbe. <laughs> 